Big data is now a big, big part of our lives. Big time. We all constantly generate, receive, and use data wherever we are and almost in everything we do. When we drive, eat, exercise, shop, walk, talk, text, read, play, or just wait there, doing nothing. Data defines where we are, who, and even with whom we are, how we feel, or even what we like. Yes, sir, that goes for you, too. However, when it comes to using big data in education, things start to become a little more complicated. As overwhelming concerns about user privacy violations by businesses and governments continue to grow, educators and students alike are reluctant to provide their personal information for educational uses. This was shown by a recent study carried out by Mindset. 1,877 Israelis were surveyed, and the majority said they were very concerned about their privacy online. The majority of the students agree that schools should not use their social network information, and the results make up a clear statement by teachers and students against the free use of students' data by the educational system, even if it's to improve learning. On the other hand, big data is revolutionizing the way we learn, and it's considered by many the foundation for education to reinvent itself. Big data has opened the door for adaptive learning systems, which use artificial intelligence or perceptual computing. Students are offered personalized learning, which is adapted to each one's specific needs. They also now have access to an immense amount of information, which had previously been available only to a privileged few. Big data can help students become much more engaged and offers much better chances to succeed. Teachers, parents, and administrators now have the chance to be constantly and immediately informed about the strengths and weaknesses of students and schools, allowing them to plan and respond more efficiently. Big data is becoming so big that it's even being used to offer predictions about students' future life successes and failures, from data gathered about the students' performance as early as in first grade. Hold it one second. Let's read this again. Do we really want algorithms to decide about the future of our children? Dilemmas like these raise the most interesting question about big data. Can it really become the next big thing in education? It definitely can. But for that to happen, we need to make sure that it's not misinterpreted as the truth, the whole truth, and nothing but the truth. Big data is an enabler that allows us to get a wider picture. We need to be well informed of the advantages of big data, but also of the risks. Big data holds an immense potential for all digital users. A responsible, open-minded, and curious approach can help us take a significant role in reconstructing a much more relevant educational system. To learn more, go to Mindset Snapshot Number 2 online and get a better picture of the impact of big data on education. Mindset. Changing Education Mindset.